Hi guys, it's Ben Heath from Lead Guru, and in this video, I'm going to talk about Facebook lookalike audiences and how you make them local. How do you advertise on a localized basis when using a Facebook lookalike audience? Something I've been asked quite a bit about. And if you've created a lookalike audience, you know, if you've been through the whole process, which just quickly is first, you need to create a custom audience. So that could be your previous customers, that could be your email list, your website visitors, something like that. And then you create a lookalike audience based off the back of that. So you basically say to Facebook, look, here are my previous customers, create me an audience of people that are very similar to my previous customers, and I want to advertise to those people. That, as you can imagine, very, very effective targeting option. But if you've been through that process and you've created your lookalike audience, you'll know that when you get to the lookalike audience creation section, you don't have the same location targeting options as you do when you're setting up your campaigns at the ad set level. So normally, it depends, you know, it differs depending on your location, but normally you need to target and you need to create a lookalike that's either nationwide or statewide or region wide, depends, as I said, depending on your location. But let's say, for example, you're in the UK, uh, but you only operate on a local basis and you create a lookalike audience that's throughout the whole of the UK, that's nationwide. We're thinking, well, I only work with people that are within, let's say, 15 miles of my office. What a waste of money to advertise to all these people across the whole country that can't go on to become my customer. So here's how you solve that problem, because it's, it's fairly straightforward. You create the lookalike audience on a nationwide basis or a statewide basis, wherever you happen to be. That's absolutely fine. And then... At the ad set level, when you target that lookalike audience at the top, you also add in your location targeting parameters there. Because at the ad set level, that's how your campaigns work. It's an and function. So you're saying to Facebook, I want to advertise to people that are within this lookalike audience and are within this location. So you can be within your lookalike audience and let's say 15 miles you know, radius around your office. That because of that, and that's how it works with all the targeting criteria at the ad set level, because when you use a lookalike audience, I'd recommend leaving everything else off. So don't have a narrow age range, don't add in other interest targeting options, otherwise you'll make your audience too small. Now, on top of that, when you're advertising on a local basis, your audience is going to be much, much smaller. So let's say, for example, you're in the UK and you're targeting a 1% lookalike audience. Well, a 1% lookalike audience in the UK is 410,000 people. But if you only operate to people that are local, let's say 15 miles from your office, that might be a tiny, tiny audience. You might be getting down to sort of, you know, 10, 15,000 people, which is too small for a Facebook ad campaign to be effective. So what you want to do is you want to make your original lookalike audience when you're creating it at the nationwide or state level as large as possible. So make that, let's say, a 10% lookalike because that'll be 10 times as large. And then when you go to narrow the criteria down, at the, uh, at the ad set level by your location, hopefully that resulting lookalike, the resulting target audience that you're, you're uh, actually gonna be advertising to isn't too small. It's a reasonable size and your Facebook ad campaigns can run well. Okay, hopefully that video has been useful. Just before we go, something else I wanna quickly wanna mention, and that's my Facebook ads mastermind group, which is a free Facebook group for you to join. It's got over seven and a half thousand members, all active Facebook advertisers, there are loads of Facebook ads agency owners in there, and it's a great community. So there's lots of people answering questions, um, you know, asking how do I achieve this with Facebook advertising. It's all to do with Facebook advertising. So if you want better results from your Facebook ads, I would highly, highly recommend that you click on the link. There'll be a link in the video description. Go ahead and join, it's completely free, and, uh, and get involved and get your questions answered. The other thing I'll mention is that if you're not familiar with how to create lookalike audiences, all that sort of stuff, there will be links in the video description. So if I sort of glossed over details that you're like, what, how do I create those? I've got detailed tutorials show exactly how to do that. So make sure you check those out. As I said, if you found this video useful, please give it a like. Um, subscribe to my channel for more Facebook advertising related content and leave a comment to let me know what you liked about it, what you didn't. And um, of course, if you've got any questions, pop them in the comments. I will get to them. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye-bye.